Hey loves, what's up? It's your girl Sun Republic and welcome back to another video. So like it says in the title below, this is my fragrance collection. Okay, some are new, some are not so new. Okay, I went out today and I kind of splurged to get some new fragrances that I was into and some fragrances that I have been liking and that I've been wanting to get. A lot of them are testers but i'm so happy that i've made these purchases and i want you guys to indulge and smell good too because you can't be part of the same gang and not have good scent or not smell good okay i want y'all to smell good too i want y'all to invest a coin into this as well to start off with perfume oils that i have you can get these at Gatesville they smell amazing okay they smell amazing this one is a crown concentrated perfume oh it smells to die for okay it's got a citrusy sweet beautiful citrusy sweet scent it's really really strong and it's got like an orangey Mm, it just smells so good. Okay, this stains. Do not put it on white clothes. Put it on your skin. And maybe if you've got like something leather or something, you know. It's a very sweet scent. It can be very overpowering, but I love this. I got this in Gatesville, like I mentioned. Amazing, beautiful, sweet perfume. Longevity. Can last long if you don't have high acidity levels. Uh, the lasting power of pure perfumes are different for everybody. I just love the smell of this and I wear it all the time. I haven't been quite a big fan of rose perfumes, but I've been trying to get my nostrils to grasp the scent. And to start off with that, um, I had also Crown Perfumes Red Rose. This is a full on rose perfume. It's sexy. It is rosy. It is a bit musky. It is, oh, it's great for winter. Perfect. Perfect for winter. Winter, autumn, slash fall, whatever you call it. Perfect. I think I'm almost done with it. it I used it a lot during winter and completely sexy. Next perfume that I have is a full jasmine perfume, also from Crown Perfumes. Also, I got it in Gatesville. You know how we like our utters, um, or should I say how I like my utters? Utters are basically like a oil-based perfume, so it's like this concentrate. It's oil concentrated perfume, like fragrance oil. That's it. Okay. <laughs> And it's strong longevity can last up to 48 hours or sit on your clothes on your skin for quite a long time this is a pure jasmine perfume and i'm telling you i've been loving jasmine you know i've been loving jasmine perfumes and this let me tell you something this when i put this on it's always like oh my god what are you wearing um you smell so good. You smell amazing. This right here. <coughs> this right here. It is this right here. If you don't want to spend a lot of money on branded high name perfumes, spend your coin on Atters, okay? The longevity is good. Uh, it smells great. They are various ranges. It's very oriental. Most of them are quite oriental, which means they are strong. They woody scents and then you can always search for what you like so disclaimer i am not a professional when it comes to perfume i just know my things and i know what i like always before you buy full bottles get testers to see if you actually like the perfume or not these are just my opinions and my likings to these specific perfumes that i currently have that is in my current collection conquer dark daring duchess i like this because i use it as a body mist okay i use it as a body mist it is very lemony very citrusy great for the summer 
it doesn't really last long but you can layer it as like a base scent and add on more floral or citrusy scents on top of this uh i would say maybe if you need to touch up the utters i bought for like 50 bucks each amazing honestly amazing and this is great it has a very mm, yeah very lemony citrusy yeah lemony it has a very lemony scent not too sweet which i like and it's also quite fresh so just quick on the go if you need to go somewhere quickly this or if you know quick touch up for the gym uh errands this right here so i've also been recently into starting to get into zara perfumes i've had my doubts don't come for me in the comments you know who you are i've had my doubts but they have been coming out with really good lines and i'm not gonna lie I, there's quite a lot that i still want to get my hands on but for the time being i've only got i recently just bought three and i was like i need to get my hands on these okay i wanted one for myself and i figured i might just get one for my mom and my aunt so most of zara perfumes fragrances are eau de toilette which means they are lighter and they have a less oil concentrate in the perfume bottles okay i'm gonna start off with the femme i like this a lot i picked this for myself because i needed something fresh and that i could wear every day as well mm, this smells clean this smells fresh out the shower with baby powder and dove soap and i smell clean uh, you'd want to wear every day um and i bought the i bought a 30 ml because obviously i wanted to test it out before buying like a full bottle oh my god it smells so freaking clean it's a soft feminine baby clean smell i love it i do recommend getting this if you are into clean fragrances and fresh fragrances something that's not too sweet um definitely get your hands on this this is the zara femme beautiful yes this is nice it's just because a lot of their perfumes actually start off with a top alcohol type of base which goes like straight up your nostrils and in your head and like oh headache but this i was like no ways of the wonder rose oh my god the audi toilet jaw dropping Obviously, I let my mom and my aunt taste out the perfumes that they wanted, but I already said the femme is mine. <laughs> Wonder Rose obviously has fruity, mm, very fruity, fruity, it's a fruity floral. It's a cute fruity floral. It's not a grown cute fruity floral, but it's like a in-between, okay? It's, it's cute it's nice it smells good it's a pleasant perfume it's soft it's not very in your face but it the it stays um, i will link all the notes of the perfumes on either side of this video other range that they had with joe malone i think if i'm not mistaken but those ones are freaking beautiful let me just get paper so i can smell this again mm very nice lovely there's very faint rose in here to be honest considering that this is a pure that the crown perfumes was a pure rose scent this smells good it's a fruity floral scent and i love it, love it, love it, love it. and then i have a uh, rose. this one is my mom's she liked it and i also thought that it would be nice on her so she does like quite pungent a little bit stronger perfumes like me but i like my strong strong perfumes this is also great it's not so great but it's very like my mom it's very like my mom pure tuberose i think there are other notes in here i'm not quite sure uh what the notes are in here but i will put them in here it's not much to say about this I personally don't like this perfume a lot. She loves it. I don't. Um, yeah, 
So this is my other baby. As you can see, I use this so freaking much. The only problem, it doesn't last long on my skin. <laughs> I constantly have to like spray, 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 spray for it to last on my skin and I'm like why? Why if it's not cheap? Why? Other than that, it's an overall sexy perfume. It's a sexy perfume, okay? Perfect for the summer, spring. Oh, it's so fucking sexy. This also has a fruity, more of a fruity than a floral based um, perfume. Beautiful, sexy. It's just that you know when you want to hug somebody and they it gives that mm, I want to hug you. Or if you spray this on somebody's jersey or scarf and you like, I'm taking the scarf just just so that I can remember you. This. So this I recently got my hands on, and this is the Kayali Elixir 11. And when I tell you, baby. you will believe it the notes in here are red apple rose de my absolute jasmine vanilla and patchouli and i love jasmine and patchouli i jasmine and patchouli in the same bottle Ugh. this is one of the most seductive perfumes i have ever smelt it's sexy. Okay, so I just realized that my mic wasn't working properly, but if you could have if you could still hear me, kudos. Okay. I have got another perfume that I recently just bought. And this is the Coach Sunset. It is so sweet and sexy and cute. I wanna open this, but I don't want to open this, but I do want to open this. So I got the 50 mil. Tell me this is not cute. So cute. Coach perfumes are nice. Hold up. Did I just break this bottle? Oh, I see. You have to like. On the spritzer. Sweet, sexy. Love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's kind of got like a woody, fruity, woody, fruity scent. So, springtime, autumn, a little bit in the summer, but late summer. I see myself wearing this in winter mm -hmm. and yeah last but not least Lancôme La Nuit Trésor listen I was gonna gatekeep this I was gonna gatekeep this but this I got this as a birthday present and when I tell you baby you gonna smell up the entire room you're going to smell up the entire room. And this is a... I think this is a 50 mom. 50 mom. Extremely sexy. Love it. Oh, amazing. This is the Kayani Vanilla 28. This is a soft, sweet vanilla. Okay? Nothing more, nothing less. It's just pure, soft, sweet vanilla. Perfect for layering. And yeah, especially for the winter time. Winter, autumn time. Perfect for layering. We'll put the notes in here, but I think this is just pure vanilla. Other than that, top notch. Okay, so that's it for today that's the entire perfume collection that i have at the moment and of course it's still growing it has to if you do want to see more videos like this please do let me know in the comments down below don't forget to like comment and subscribe 
turn on my post notifications because then you'll see my posts more and get notified whenever I have a new post and yeah that's about it too